I was actually really blown away by all the facilities um, and everything that was on offer. And also the, the cafe, and it's such a lovely space, just the decoration and the way all the colour scheme is done and the open plan nature of it and also the sunlight that comes in. And I know mum and dad really loved, I mean, they loved coming here. One of the things I also like about it is the fact that it's open, the cafe is open just to the public. So it doesn't, it doesn't feel like, although it is a specialist centre for dementia and to help people with dementia, when you're here it doesn't feel like you're in a sort of specialist sort of medical unit. It feels like you're in a really friendly, bright, just cafe having <laughs> like sausage rolls and cakes and coffee and I really I really like that aspect about it actually the daybreak service in particular has just had a, hu a huge impact on me because it's meant that I've had a I've had a I've had a break but for me, I knew they were being looked after and, and all the activities they did. So they, I mean, they, they, I, I said my dad loves poetry, they love books. And, you know, the staff have read poetry, they've read books. I've said if my dad doesn't want to talk, he can sit and listen to music and they'll put, you know, classical music on or jazz or, you know, music he liked. Um, and my mum loves all the craft activities and the bits of painting and she's actually made a really good friend here, another lady and um, so she's re she really looks forward to coming. I have um, had massages here and just being able to come and have a massage has, has been really, lo really lovely and because um, I have, you know, you do carry a lot of tension and um, that has been, they are, they are really helpful. So being able to come here and say, right, I can leave mum here and I'm free for so many hours now. It's just, and I literally, I walk out the door and I just go, and I let it go. Because I know she's all right. And I, I guess until you, till you know somebody with dementia and the impact it has, you don't realise the help that's needed. But actually there's thousands of people who need this help. And so I just think there should be a sage house in every county. To me, it's been an absolute godsend.